Pocky here. Eddie Olchek is alongside. You'll hear from Ray Ferraro in a moment. I'm Mike Emery. Tonight, we get a star-spangled lineup, the best in the world, ready to play for us. It's not just a show of myself and Ray Ferraro. We have a third man along, and he is very important. Let's hear from Eddie Olchek. Look at these all-star lineups. It's the best in the world facing off for the fans here tonight. We should see some incredible skill on display, and it should be a great time for all of us. The Pacific All-Stars have the first possession. Twist one. Save. The Atlantic All-Stars skated up on the side. Just can he beat him here. He scores. Steven Stamkos. Oh, the key, once you score one, try and get another. Push them back on their heels. They've got one. Go get two. We knew the scoreless tie would be broken. Who thought this early and by the visitors? Boy, the visitors got to gain a lot of confidence getting this early lead. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. Steven Stamkos, assisted by number 80. Brings a shot, stared him down and made the save. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Let's it go. Blocked. Canes that offensive line. And he's all alone. A good stick stop. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. A little under four minutes have gone by. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's one nothing. Takes a shot. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Drives it. Save. Directing that one to Raquel. The Pacific All-Stars skated up on the side. He's got it. Puck is thrown to Barkov. It's all on his shoulders. Wonderful save. What a skill level there. The goalie makes himself look big. The Pacific All-Stars lose one guy off their roster for this one. It's a game misconduct. The Atlantic All-Stars are going to get their first opportunity on the power play right now. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. And a game misconduct. Shot! No! Gotta get it on net! Well, that puck slowed up and just missed the side of the net. Cleared it back out of there. Long lead pass to Goudreau. That puck struck him in front. Riley is slashed on the play, and there'll be a penalty coming up. Fires. Good save there. In the slot. And now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call. McDavid's getting a penalty for slashing. It's two minutes. He's making like Paul Bunyan out there. That's a two-minute slash. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five on three power play, and it begins now. One of the biggest mistakes a five on three power play makes is they're looking for the perfect shot. The more you shoot it, the more you move the penalty killers around, and you start to tire them out. Collected by Green. Pitching this one to Kucherov. Breaks away. Oh, that's good. That might turn into something here. The Pacific All-Stars in their own end in possession as they travel. Smart recovery by Green. Gains the zone by himself. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Well, it looks like the shooter's just trying to get this puck on net. 
routine stop for the goaltender, not much challenge. Defensive zone win. Terrific determination by Hedman. Slid to Matthews. Drives ahead. A save. He did not buy the deke there. Skates it into the zone. Shot on. Outstanding save. Oh, they had a great chance. The Atlantic All-Stars keep the play going in the middle. One on one. Score! A power play goal. And it's a biggie. Oh, I like the way this power play worked. They broke into the zone nicely. They were able to move the puck around, and they cash in. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. In with it now. The Atlantic All-Stars. Long power play is over. They scored once. Propel to Manson. Perfect wrister. Got the iron with the shot. Fires. Wonderful save. Gathered up by Neal. Quick wrister. They score. It's only a one-goal game now. The goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. The goaltender thought he had that shut off. He gets across the net, but he can't shut down the top bin. It's right in it. The Pacific All-Stars has done well to get back to within one, and there's still lots of time to go. We're near the end of the first period. Neutral zone face-off one. Possession established here. Carries it on in from center. He cut that one off in the defensive end. 14 minutes, 13 seconds. Lofted back to the opposite corner. Puck loose. Strong defensive play by Huberdo. Saved there. What a tremendous hit. Stone's often the object of a target. He's so good, nobody wants to give him much room. But he gets tagged there. Strong wrister. Gloved. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Quick's made a textbook stop here. He's in good shape positionally. He makes the save, and he makes it look really easy. Good job on the draw. Skilled play by Carlson. Shoots. Score! He got iron with that shot. Well, I guess this game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. And they've won the faceoff. Stolen at center ice. The Pacific All-Stars with a neutral zone possession along the way. Looking to Stamkos. Shoots one, two, players splat to the boards. Oh, he got thumped against the boards. The glass is still rattling. 2-2 two, two at the end of one. 
So both of these teams were able to strike twice. We'll see if that builds some confidence or whether the goaltenders rally when we get into the second period of play. Stay warm and stylish in the ring with our specially... The Pacific All-Stars collected the last goal of the period and it succeeded in tying the game. Here it is again. We'll have more in a moment. Period two is underway, and neither team has a big advantage yet. Even the score is even. Shot! Outstanding point-blank save. He's locked in now. Great save. Shoots! Score! <laughs> Man, they're excited here. They've broken the tie. They've got the lead. But now you have to concentrate and get right back down to work. The Pacific All-Stars have taken the lead by one. What fork in the road are we headed for with this face-off? It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Shoots! Hung right over him and couldn't get it passed. Time of the goal. One minute, 34 seconds. Leads that charge into the zone. Turned away. To Barkov. Laid on to Matthews. Tremendous hit. Doubt he's not shy to throw his body around here at any time. Up that right side to Eichel. Breakaway. A solo rush. The Pacific All-Stars have it in their own end. He was outnumbered, but not outskilled. Pitching it to Barkov. Smart recovery by Muzzin. And now it's directed to Neal. Chip to Stone. A shot. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. You got to think that's a game-changing save there. Routine save. The Atlantic All-Stars are driving it from the wing. It all alone! Score! And this one is tied! I guess at this point, guys, it doesn't really matter what the game looks like. It's back to even square and we'll find out who's going to take the lead next. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Whatever the game plan was in both dressing rooms, it might have been to... Alone! The Pacific All-Stars continue on in the defensive zone. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Broke it right up! Moving it to Stamkos. Snapping a pass to Kucherov. Breakaway chance! An aggressive poke check on the breakaway! Scooped up by Steven Stamkos. On to Marshan. In all alone. Oh, what a save. He didn't take the fake. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Up the left side to Stamkos. 
steps in from the neutral zone. Breakaway. He's all alone. Save. Dogged determination there by Stamkos. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. That was a tougher stop than a look. I don't think the shooter got much on this, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick stop on a relatively easy shot. A little under three minutes remaining. Game tied at this point, three goals apiece. They won that battle in the dots. That pass was off the mark, so they'll have to try it again, organizing at center. The Atlantic All-Stars have it along the breaks free. Nearly grazed the iron on that. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Star! been a number of close chances here at either end as this continued tie game strung out. Now they've got the lead. We'll see where it takes us now. The Pacific All-Stars have taken a late second period lead in this one. That might change the conversation in the locker room at the Horn. And the face-offs won. By number 28, Leon Assisted by number 39, Pass finds its way up the wing to Goudreau. Downing. Time of the goal, 19 minutes, 37 seconds. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Hey, hockey fans, follow the team all season long on the radio for every minute of play-by-play -play action. Dreisaitl's marker late in that period will give his team a lift going into intermission time now. Two periods played, one period ahead. What are your thoughts so far, Eddie? The Pacific All-Stars have to be pleased with leading this high-scoring affair, but I'm sure their coaching staff has emphasized to them in the intermission that they have to be better defensively. If they are, they have more than enough goals to win this game. Stands him up, trying to go to Doughty. And he steps across the line. Solid work there by Steven Stamkos. He's got the breakaway. It's just him. Oh, Pocek saved one there. That didn't go like he wanted. Using the point. Very important steal for him. Pass attempt to Besser. Wow, look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? Cuts through. Passing one off now to Marshand. Breakaway! He scores! Stamkos! You get the lead, you want to pin the lead down. You want to give yourself the opportunity to spread the lead out. But they don't. They give up the tying goal. And now we're back to even. The Atlantic All-Stars couldn't have picked a better time to get this game back even. They've had an advantage in time of possession. And there's still plenty of time left here in the third. And they take that neutral zone faceoff. Steven Stamkos, assisted by... Heads to the crease! Brad Marchand... Directing that one to Kopitar. A backhand shot. Took care of that one. To Barkov. Good work there in goal. Took it up the boards and holds. Takes it right back. Slid to Matthews. Grabbed. Puck is thrown to Muzzin. Driving in from no man's land. Fire stings it off the iron. A shot. Great save. Riley is trying to work his way to center ice. Just like shootout. 
A shot. Can't get it on net. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Oh, what a terrific save in close. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. Fires. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Just under seven minutes remaining in the period. A hockey game is one of lead changes, and this one has seen its lead vanish. A great wrist shot. That puck hit him on the way to the net. The Pacific All-Stars are skating it up in neutral ice. Wonderful stop. It's always way more fun when there's lots of goals in the game. The players like it. Well, the offensive ones do. The defensive ones aren't so crazy about it. But I will tell you who hates it. It's the coaches. They always want to have some control of the game. Good intercept in his own end. He's alone. He only got the outside of the post. Gathered up again by Stone. A heartening collision. You thought they were gone. They're not. Open. It's all on his shoulders. Punched away. All tied up in the final minute of regulation. On the outside, a shot. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Gathered up again by Marshan. Steps across that line. Biggest chance of the game. Save! Couldn't have handpicked a better guy to be on a breakaway, and he stopped him. A huge save late in the game. And a save. Flings it. May not have intended it, but it hit it. Got the save there. Have no idea how he stopped that traffic all over the front of the net, but he keeps the game tied with a terrific stop. Centermen practice this so many times at the end of their game day workouts. And here comes the biggest one, perhaps, of the whole season. Pitching this one to Matthews. The Atlantic All-Stars have it at center ice. Can he beat him here? Remarkable save. No sale on the old fake out. The Pacific All-Stars with possession up the wing. A shot. No time to react. Didn't need it. Save. That great save was all positioning. A tremendous back and forth through three periods. Perhaps a decision will come in sudden death overtime. Hey fans, we'd like to draw Stamco's goal to has sent us to overtime. And that period will begin in just a moment. We have begun sudden death overtime. If no one scores in this next stretch, we'll be headed for a shootout. Propelled to Carlson. Save there. The Pacific All-Stars lug the puck in the defensive zone. Shoots. Save. Looking to Stamkos. Laid on to Marshand. Pass. Score! The overtime winner, and the players spill over the boards to celebrate. And that's the end of this one. The game has ended. When it gets to OT, it seems like the smallest thing can happen and then go wrong for a team. In this case tonight, it went right for one. The little extra plays that make all the difference. Some nights are special in memory. This one was an outstanding game. So long for now.